In this case, we will discuss the indications for doing a free gingival graft. The patient presented in our office seeking for treatment of the recession in the lower central incisor. However, we also see that we have no attached gingiva and that we also have a frenum in the area that is pulling the free gingival margin and probably has initiated this recession. So our treatment of choice is to do a split thickness flap, remove the frenum, and apply a free gingival graft in the area. It is very important to stabilize the free gingival graft very well and there is no mobility of the graft upon movement of the lip. This is the healing two weeks later where we can see that we still have some recession. However, we don't have any more the frenum pulling the free gingival margin. Now we need to wait and to apply good oral hygiene in the area. And four weeks later, we can see that the tissue starts getting more mature. Being more patient, 12 weeks later, we can see that with creeping attachment, the recession has been completely covered. Five years later, we can see that we were able to achieve a very good and stable result by using the technique of free gingival graft to cover the recession on the lower incisor area. Thank you.